What's up, everybody? I'm Big Mike. And I'm Brando. And I'm Clinton. And this right here is Brewheads. You're, You're damn, damn right. right. Still like it. All right, today we got one from Captain Lawrence. Now, you may mm -hmm. remember Captain Lawrence from Clinton's constant ravings about... Frost Monster. There it oh, is. Yeah. That Frost Monster. All right, today we got... Uh, we have Soft Swerve Orange yeah. Cream. Ooh. Yeah. With that little, little, little... <whistles> over the E. Creme. I'm going to... All right. Follow us on our uh, social medias, especially them grams. What are we doing, Mike? Popping. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Yep. Yep. Wow. So I'm not going to read any of this. No. Let's see. Uh, Damn. Ooh, tell me Ooh, what you got. All right. So that color, I, it looks, I know it looks completely different in the camera. Yeah. We, but. We got to do something about that. Damn. No, you know what? There's, there's nothing we're going to be able to really do about. Cause just the way the lighting is. Until our summer set comes along. Yeah, maybe we could do something with the summer set. But uh, oh, that man. looks thick. That yeah, that color is. I get. I and just, it's mostly and the aroma. Of I don't see. I get minimal oh. aroma. You don't. You don't. But I also have a, a big. It's head here. really really sweet smelling. Now, do you get just citrus or do you get orange? No, I get like orange, like sherbet. Okay. Like sweet, orangey. What do you get? Man, I, I don't get much of anything. No? You need another yeah, port and polish? Is this, is this... It's very faint in this? It's not popping. It's there, but it's not popping out. Oh, damn. Yeah! Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> oh! I, like, I'm not much coming from there. I, the... I smell... What? I don't know what the... No, no, no. And the difference so, to the head. So, no, smell his. Right. Smell his. And this smell this sounds gross, but... <laughs> Orange. Orange sherbet. Could yeah. you pick up a smell with that? Yeah. It's, it's so I think I think I got I think the smell is at the bottom of the glass yeah, on this one. Mike at the top. There. <laughs> Man. All right, let's give me a sip. sip. I wanna know. I wanna know. Ooh. Ooh. Summertime drink? That's like I, that's that's a I don't even know how to explain that. That's it's Bittery orange. Oh damn! Wheat finish. It is a little wheat, but not not, not too not, bad. No, not, not, I, not I know that bad. reaction was yeah. uh, was. I, re <laughs> caught me up. I wasn't expecting the wheat finish. It, the it reaction came wheat. out of nowhere. The reaction when I saw it was like, "Well, oh, that's a two. Yeah. <laughs> no, I, it, it, it is just, wheat. It caught me off guard. But no, it has like this. You know how orange sherbet is like bittery orange. Yep. It is literally just like that. It's like an it orange sherbet. Creamy, all. smooth, bittery. Yeah. It could be me, but it has like a soury kind of feel to it. It does. That's that like orangey, that, that bittery orange almost towards it. Because the way it's kind of still sweet but bitter gives you almost like um, uh, how CT Valley does their sours almost. Okay. Um, it gets weedier as you drink too. But... It is surprisingly weedy. I am yeah. with you with that. It, 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 you don't. It was not there at the start, and then all when, of a sudden, it just it came in like a rainbow, like <laughs> boom, <laughs> like Rick. Re that's. I don't think that's where right. the song goes. But... I know it's a wrecking ball, but it, I figured <laughs> rainbow. I didn't want copyright infringements. I don't know. <laughs> Trust me, man. I think enough of that was copyright <laughs> infringible or infringible. <laughs> Is this, a, just... is this a beer that you think the brewery should be proud of? Yeah. Yeah. No, nope. this is... Go ahead, continue. <laughs> <laughs> this ear shut off. And then I would look... <laughs> no, I would I, be... You know, I don't, I'm not a big fan of wheat. Like, and it, okay. it's, it's, heavy, it's heavy wheat. It, well, it's, it, it's heavy on it the is top. Hev it is the heavy wheat. on the... But I think the wheat is not... Will not deter... Will the wheat... Does the wheat actually deter you from drinking more? Yeah. Okay. Damn. Yeah. If you were to describe I, this beer, as to, I drink, it's getting meatier. <clears throat> if you were to describe this beer to like you know other craft beers, you know beerists out there, uh, what would uh, what would be something you would talk about with this beer besides weedy? I mean, the initial flavor is amazing. Okay. I wouldn't say creamsicle, initial flavor. Okay. Um, would you mind? No, like I said, I would, I would give it like a sherbet because of yeah. the bitterness. There yep. you go. I would say it's more sherbet. Yeah. Uh, it almost it almost has like a sherbet kind of like 
texture mm -hmm. like as you're drinking it even though it's not um yeah i mean yeah sherbet's a good way to describe it um and we which they don't go together those two things in my opinion sherbet and wheat do not go together like i mean you can taste the the creativity behind it. i mean it's amazing um absolutely another another um great uh product that they're putting out mm -hmm. just not for me um yeah i mean I, I mean if somebody gave this to me i mean i mean i would drink it uh, i mean I, I wouldn't go out and purchase it okay me. yeah that was one of the things i was going to ask would you <clears throat> would you go out and buy this i wonder if <clears throat> temp wise if it was just a smidget colder like maybe like five to seven degrees colder if we give it that more of a sherbet feel yeah maybe it would <laughs> dull some of that wheat dull some of the wheat wheat because i mean i mean it's 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 a it's definitely like in the 30s but it's probably like more like 38 did we you, when you picked this up did the can art did the can have anything to do with why you bought it because we do can yeah. shop so yeah, yeah yeah so the two things one the the picture yeah Soft serve, I'll take it. And plus, also, I've had another one, so it was different. The pineapple one. Okay. So it was like, oh, I like the pineapple one. Let me try that one. If you were to associate this beer with a particular type of music, what would it be? Techno. All right. You know what's funny is that's actually pretty fucking good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, yeah, you know what? Yeah. <laughs> Realistically speaking, I don't think there's any right answer to this question. But I'm all like, F dude, that shit was a good. Um, let me hit this one more time. Polka. <laughs> <laughs> all right, moving on. Is there any? Are there any assumptions that you made? Looking at it, smelling it, that were totally different from the taste. Lack of wheat. <laughs> yeah. Lack of wheat. I'll the, give you that. The wheat is definitely uh, <laughs> not was I, I was expecting more of a hop okay. than a wheat. Because in all honesty. I think that, to be honest, deep down, that's. Because usually. Yeah, something like this wheat, it's always had. Yeah, to. it'll. Fucking ghost again. Fuck out of here. Get out of here, ghost. All right, before we get to ratings, I, got, oh, I love this question. Is uh, If you were going to die in a year, would this beer make the list of no. you? No? Okay. <laughs> you? Okay. But you would, you would drink it? I'll, I'll, you... I'll, I will be honest with you. Frost Monster will be on that list. <laughs> Frost Monster will be on that list. Yeah. Yeah, no, this, this beer is not on the list, you know, if I'm dying in a year that yeah. I must have. No. <laughs> well, like we've always said, it's all about palates, and yeah. uh, now i got to ask that question. Give me a rating, Mike. Uh, Damn. 375. I was going to go three. It's really, really good. And I can see how the the wheat flavor, because it is so unexpected. That's Do you all. think now, say sitting down a week from now, having it, expecting that wheat would make a difference? That's a good question, dude. That is a, that, that is a good question. I don't, you know what? I don't, now that I've had it, if I had it a week later... I still, the wheat flavor would still come at me out of nowhere. Okay. Yeah, uh, yeah I think, like I said, I'm going to go three. Uh, it's drinkable, like I said. It's uh, very surprising. If uh, you're the kind of person that don't like surprises, don't buy this beer. <laughs> <laughs> um, Inventiveness that, does come that, in the form of surprises. That so. does, you know, intrigue, the question you just asked intrigues me in the sense that, like, you know, now that I've had it, if I have this, like, a week down the road, would my opinion change? I mean, I'm not a huge fan of wheat, um, you know, the wheat flavor, um, and as you do drink this, the wheat flavor kind of lays on thicker. Mm -hmm. um, but, like I said, I mean, as, as you probably, probably saw in my reaction while we're drinking this, and if you didn't see it, take a little rewind back. <laughs> uh, the we'll wheat caught it. me off guard, <laughs> heavy, and I, I in, my brain went to, nah, the same for me. Like, But, like I said, I'm, I'm actually kind of curious if i did have it a week now you know later knowing we'll, we'll test that theory yeah i mean yeah but yeah i'm gonna go with a three so yeah so uh that's our thoughts on uh oh actually i forgot something 
Oh, 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 yeah. Tell yeah. Us, tell so, us about this, shit. this is Captain Lawrence Brewing Company Soft Swerve. See, I would have bought that just for the name. Yeah. Soft Swerve, like, pfft. Uh, orange makes cream. A soft turn in the direction of the beer. Going. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's not a soft turn. No, it's not <laughs> soft turn. Uh, this is a milkshake IPA, India Pale Ale brewed with orange, va orange vanilla, and milk sugar. You got any vanilla in this? No. No. What do you guys, uh, what do you guys think this rings in at for uh, horsepower? Six and a half. I was gonna say six and a half. All right. Six. No, six eight. Seven and a half. Ah, shit. Oh. Horsepower by okay. volume, one pint, 16 fluid ounces. So that's our thoughts on Sauce Swerve. Uh, if you've had it, let us know in the comments. If you had any other variation of this, because there is actually quite a few variations of this beer. Let us know in the comments also. All right. Thanks and, for watching. And as always, drink responsibly, stay wobbly. See you on the next one. Deuces.